Hello humans, I'm Yoshi and I've got a little bit of bad news. Well, actually it's kind of major, but uh... I can't really do requests anymore for this walkthrough. One, twenty-two. So while I battle this guy, I'll explain. A lot of the requests I ended up taking are not going to be doable in this walkthrough because they contradict each other and or they, they're just flat out not possible. Like, some require me to get Pokemon that I cannot get at this point in the game. So, ooh, Flame Wheel, heck yeah! So, the only two requests I'll be doing, there's only two more I'm going to do and they'll be shown up on the screen right now. Otherwise, I'm just going to beat the rest of the game with my team, so I'm sorry for those that left requests. Sorry, okay. Anywho, I'm going to breeze through this bug gym. Uh, so Waddle's a bug grass type, so it's four times weak to fire, and Growlithe is just going to destroy this thing. Especially since he now has a physical fire type attack. So, oh yeah. And Cairo is now level 17. Excellent. So sorry to be the bearer of bad news. First I cancelled Wi-Fi matches, now I'm canceling the requests. Like, a lot of the stuff I want to do this walkthrough for this walkthrough apparently just isn't gonna happen, and I'm sorry for that, but not much I can do, unfortunately. Anyway, let me battle you. You just came out of a frickin' I don't know what that is. Anyway, this guy is a juggler, and I guess jugglers use bug types. A combi, that's something. Well, I want to say something new, but it's actually a Gen 4 Pokemon, but that's something different, that's for sure. Either way, I'm going to Flame Wheel you. Die, Combi. Nobody uses you or Vespaquin anyway. You know, speaking of not being used a whole lot, I'm actually going to swap to Rog and Rolla here, hopefully, or Rocker, so he can get some experience points. Let's go, Rocker! He's holding the... He's holding the heart stone, so his rock type attacks will increase. So let's see. That's all you got? Come on now. One! A two! Only two? Alright, I'll kill you this turn then. Friggin' swab loons. Ah, uh, that's gonna kill me. Darn, you are smart. And you got a critical hit, so I really wasn't gonna stand a chance. Alright, alright, I'll go back to Blaze, and I'll just have to heal up sometime later. Alright, Ember it, since that's all I'm really going to need. Bah, Swabloon! Let's see... Almost leveled up. Cairo grew to level 18. Jeez, Cairo, you were just getting stronger and stronger. Eventually, I'll actually be able to use you for battle, and then your friendship will increase, and you'll evolve into Lucario. Awesome. Right, so anyway, I don't know how I'm just getting sucked into these things, and how I'm actually able to... No, oh, can I get out through here? No? Okay. I don't know how I can actually, like, fit through these little... What are these, cocoons? I guess these are cocoons. I don't know how I can get sucked into them and then shot up through them without suffocating. This is the dangerous gym, dude. Alright, anyway. Where's the waddles? You know there's other bug types that are Gen 5. You have Shelmet and Aesogore and... And Durant. Nobody uses Durant. Durant is there. Level 18. Oh, yeah. Any other bug types? There's the other trade evolution one. And then there's Dwebble! Haha! <laughs> Forgot about you, Dwebble! Hello, Dwebble. Ah, not Sand Attack! And there's plenty of previous generation ones too, like Butterfree and Beedrill and Heracross and Pinsir and Scyther and. 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 Oh, Scorapy and Wurple, and yeah, I think I've named enough bugs. There's plenty of bug types. Why do I keep missing? Come on, flame wheel, let's go. I don't know if you're using uh, Rock Polish or Iron Defense, but probably uh, Rock Polished, because you're faster than me now. And that didn't kill you. Alright, one more flame wheel. Come on, Growlithe. Alright. And die! Goodbye. Go. Let's, I'm actually gonna swap just in case. So let's go, Jolt. Jolt will be able to take care of this. Booga 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 booga. Combi, man, I should say Rocker for this thing. Whatever. All right, quick attack. Cause Combi is four times weak to Rock. Whatever. It happens. 
Quick attack it again and finish it off, Jolt! There you go. Goodbye, Combi. Okie dokie. And that is that. Alright, so I guess I gotta go this way, okay. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, actually I think I'm gonna go back and heal, so is this gonna take me back? This is gonna take me here, then what's this way gonna take me to? I guess I'm already at the gym leader, but I'm not gonna fight Berg just yet. I'm gonna heal, and I'm gonna go back up, and then I'm gonna fight Berg. Oh, okay, this must be a shortcut to get back to the gym leader quicker. I like that. Okay. So, let me e uh, register the bicycle since I don't have that registered. Now when I press the Y button, or V on my keyboard, I can uh, use the bicycle. And the bicycle has its own catchy jingle, but once you leave the room you're in, for the lack of a better term, uh, the music just goes back to whatever that area's theme is. Anyway, let me heal up, and I don't think I need any items, so I should be good. And then, I'm, this is probably going to be the last gym where I use something that's weak to the gym, so I'm still going to take Snivy with me and have Snivy get <laughs> defeated. But, uh, nonetheless... And for those curious, Snivy is not part of my team. I used a Snivy, rather a Superior, in my original white walkthrough. And because of that, I don't plan to use another Superior. So, let me just go back to the top of this gym. So I will not be using Snivy in this walkthrough. Sorry. That's just how it is. Alright, now, we can battle! Let's go! This is Berg! Artie? His name's not Artie, though I guess that would be a fitting name. Anyway, this dude is an artist, and he is a bug-type gym leader, starting off with a Swadloon, bug grass-type, the evolution of Swaddle, and if I recall correctly, a good physical attacker. Anywho, let's just flame wheel this thing. Because it's four times weak to both fire and flying, it shouldn't be too much of a challenge, and I killed it in one hit. Awesome job, Blaze! Cairo, now level 19. Copycat. Uh, copycat is a decent attack. It's ideal for Ryolu, but I'm not going to teach it to Ryolu. It makes whatever attack was used last happen, even if you were the one using the attack last. And I know what people will do is they'll use Roar, and then they'll just spam the heck out of Copycat, because Ryolu can have an ability that makes attacks that don't do damage go first. And because Copycat doesn't necessarily do damage, it'll go first. Okay, Targe is dead. Whatever. That's out of the way. Well, I don't want to give it to Riolu, because that's too risky for one, and number two, I don't want to be a cheaper like that. So, yeah. Okay. That's that. Bam. One. Two. Three. Oh, dang. Nice job, Rocker. Critical hit. Nice. You are rocking, Rocker. Alright, this last Pokemon is his main Pokemon, and I'm going to go back to Growlithe for good reasons. You will see why in a second. His last Pokemon is Lee Vanny! I don't know why it's a guy. I don't even know why guy Lee Vannies exist. Ash has a male Lee Vanny in the anime, but like, Lee Vanny just seems so much more fitting as a girl. By the way, it's the evolution of Swadloon and the final evolution of Swaddle. Bug grass type, good physical attacker. Uh, yeah. Give it Bug Bite and Leaf Blade and it's good to go. I think that was Fury Cutter. I survived and this should kill you. But because it's 4 times weak to fire and flying, it's not very good. Bye, Lee Manny. Ooh, nice! 1,000 experience points. Level 19. Reversal! Reversal does more is, an, is a fighting type attack that deals more damage the less HP you have. But it's more ideal for something with Sturdy or holding a Focus Sash or something. Cairo is level 20! Nice! This is just going my way. So, Reversal's not really an ideal attack for Growlithe. Anywho, that battle was over quickly, and now I'm getting the Beetle Badge, I believe it is. Either way, it's my third Gym Badge for this game. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Cool. But then I get TM76 Struggle Bug. A physical bug type attack that, uh... I forget where it is. Physical bug type attack though, but I don't plan to teach it to anything. At least right now. I don't know if I'll teach it to anything later, but we'll see. Anywho, let me go and heal up, and then I guess I'll just go ahead and end this part. So... 
Let me... Oh, I guess I could have gotten on my bicycle. Let me do that. Bam! Bicycle. Now it's really just like New York City. Alright. Except I'm not carrying people in a little carriage behind me. Because there are people in New York that will do that. They'll carry people in a carriage and they'll ride a bike. Okay. So... That's that. Oh, I can deposit Snivy, I suppose. And then now that I've got more money, I can buy more junk, and yeah. So, PC. Da -da. There you go, Pat Rats. Here's your Snivy. There we go. And like I said at the beginning of this part, at this point, I'm just really going to beat the game with the rest of my team. So, yeah. Uh -huh. Take four of those. And that'll do it. Alright, and then there's one building here where you can... Where there's people that speak different languages, and in the Japanese copy of the game, one person will actually speak English. And I found them in my original white walkthrough. But it's a building in the back that I haven't covered yet. Oh, hey, dude. You're that Team Plasma guy, aren't you? We'll just call you question mark, question mark, question mark for now. And yes to everything. I have no idea what you're rambling on about, but I'm just saying yes anyway. Huh. <sighs> Also, just a bit of random advice. If you're ever reading in an English class and someone says you should read the voice of Captain Ahab, don't do it, especially with a pirate voice, because he rambles on a lot. I'm referring to Moby Dick. Anyway, uh, the building is right here that has the uh, English-speaking trainers. I don't know if it's still in this game, but I'm going to check it out anyway. There's lots of people in here. All right, let's have a look-see. Floor 47. Okie dokie. Let's see. This, I guess they got rid of it. Oh, what's this? Charcoal? Heck yeah, I'm glad I looked in here. This will boost the, this will boost the power of fire type attack, so I can give that to Growlithe as opposed to the choice spec. Not choice spec. Uh, what's it called? Skill plans. I don't know why I was thinking choice spec. That's a completely different item. There we go. So now Rog and Rolla has the hard stone, Eevee has the silk scarf, and Riolu just has the experience share. But whatever. Now Growlithe can join in on the fun with a attack boosting thing and I guess I'm nearing the end in this part so I don't I don't know if the uh, different language speaking trainers are still in this game but whatever anyway that wraps up this part of Pokemon White 2 and I'd like to thank you all for watching see you all next time in the next part when I continue on with my journey bye bye